Hey everybody. Good evening. Um, I have a car amplifier today. Um, the customer say this amplifier is burning the fuse slowly. Um, so let's see if we can try to figure out what is the problem. I don't see any burn marks on this unit anyway. I don't have much experience uh, experience on amplifier but how hard can it be first basic things that, that what I want to see if there is a source anyway okay hmm? All the paper could be there to get done. Alice, Alice, yeah. Sam. Yeah. First basic things that we can have a look is what is our condition on the main power rail. This is the ground, I think. If I'm not wrong. Yeah, that's the ground. Look there, guys. <clears throat> this is definitely ground. Okay. Not minus negative. Yeah, that's the ground. It's written here ground, uh, battery plus, and this one is supposed to be connected with the ignition. Let's have a look. No short. This is the battery plus. Check battery plus and negative. You see, this track is battery plus. Look at my multimeter. Twenty-seven ohm. One zero two. Nearly zero. So this track is coming. Okay. There is the fuse. I think the fuse is good. Yeah, this track is coming here. Then there is a coil here. Yep, this track is coming here. So we need to see what is going on with our all our ICs. Okay. There is also a diode here, guys. A diode here. So the di the diode can be blown. The diode also can be pulled. I can see this 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 amplifier is being worked on. You see, these ones they are factory solder, but this ones, um, you know what? Good, good.
as you guys can see all this bigger transistor they are not showing me any short wave this is not short this is not short this one is not short Okay, this one is all reading is zero. You guys, uh you guys seeing my multimeter zero this one you can see this one zero zero every reading is zero but this is good good see so let's remove this <coughs> transistor first and then we will see if we still have short okay Nice. Have a look at my multimeter. I don't see any shot. No shot. This is not short. No shot. The shot is gone. Um, let's have a look what we have here. PEP fifty and O six. PEP fifty and O six. Uh, let's see. PEP fifty one oh six. RFP similar one RFP. Wait guys, I might have this one. Have a look. Some of the I did buy some component last week. Let me have a look. One of my sister.
QP 50N06 FQP 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 50N06 So basically it's a 50M 60 volt MOSFET uh. Okay, I so 50 volt, sorry, 50 amp, 60 volt MOSFET. So, what do you say? We replace it and then have a look what happens. I'll do that. Single short is gone. Okay, let's just test it, guys. Check in my multimeter. On diode mode, we have right ready charge. How short? As a mode, no short guys, no short. I'm telling you guys, no short. Still has a short. Still has shot. See, still has shot. Why? And now there is nothing. Okay, guys, I am done shouldering it. Uh, let me show you guys. They look good. They look good. I did put the thermal paste and everything. Now let's put it in the in the case. Then we gonna test. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I have to show you guys. Uh, check on my multimeter. It's on continuity. Let's have a look. Can you guys see? No short. Can you guys see? No short. No short. We don't have any short. Okay. So it is safe for us to plug this one onto the power. Okay. But first, I want to. Put it on the on the on the shell, you see, because of the heat sinks. I'm afraid if uh, the IC gets too hot, it will probably burn my new ICs. So let's not do that. Uh, we gonna rather put it on the case first, and then we will test it. Okay. Okay, guys, let's. 
paste negative and that two wire plus battery plus and the ignition must be together so the plus goes on there moment of yeah. truth fingers crossed hey. i hope it's not gonna burst it didn't burst no popping no booming nothing so light 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 green light can you guys see we have a green light yes light is on see you guys no. <laughs> okay now let's check some voltage hmm? we have one, two. I need a ground. I need a ground. One yet? You can take it here. We got nine volt. Oh, sorry. Huh? Here, Saki for a Why not ask him? Yeah, no, it's not. Got a feeling that we don't have enough amp um, currents, but let's first figure out the voltage. What we have, we have 10 volt. As you can see on my on my power supply, the voltage is low because I think uh, the amp I and mean, current is not enough. 10 volt. But let's see on the 15, 17. Otherwise, this one is minus 17. Good. Okay, minus 17. Plus 17. Minus 17. Sorry, man. I'm just busy with the. Yeah, no worry. Okay. Um. We have this one 17 plus 17 is present, minus 17 is there, minus 17 is there, and this channel plus 17 is there. So, means all these channels we have are out of my uh, general common sense is saying this is working. I understand. Seventeen. Seventeen. Is ten volt. That should be twelve volt. But now my power supply is only supplying ten volt. I don't know why. The voltage drop because I did set the voltage on 12 volts. See, but we will figure that one out later. Three volts. Yeah. I want to know if this thing display okay I see here is a problem guys there is a cap missing yeah we need to figure out what can we do with that mm -hmm. 
I have no idea what cap can go there. Right, but, 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 I think we can have a look what I see is this one. This I see, uh, we, we probably gonna find a, what do you call it? There is an IC here, you see. It should have a data sheet so we can figure out what will be this this cap, okay? Let's put this one off first before we go forward. Um, PL four nine four C one. Let's have a look. Relation control This is some type of controller chip, guys. Let's go through with it. Okay, guys, we need to put a capacitor here. Uh, you can't see. Let me show you guys. Yeah. Have a look. I think this is the plus. Right, this capacitor is connected. This plus is connected. Bit number eight and eleven and twelve. So keep it in mind. Number twelve, eleven and eight. So I find a video on YouTube. Someone else is uh, explaining how this this uh, TL four nine four. 94 chip works it's an amplifier amplifier <coughs> IC you can make amplifier with it now have a look where I pause the video he is this pin 12 as you guys can see pin number 12 this one this one he is using two uh, Capacitor one and two, right? One is one of uh, ceramic capacitor, one of them. The second one, 100 microfarad, 25 volt. You see, there you go. So, I'm going to use as I'm assuming, I'm, I'm thinking this will be the right value because this is also on number 12 pin okay um, then we'll see what happened so let's put that i have the capacitor i have a brand new capacitor and here it is yeah one of 
five degree hundred microfarad. So we're gonna use that. I just need to figure out which way it should go. Better than factory, better than factory. Okay. Now, give me a few minutes. I'm going to, before we go forward, okay, let's, let's, we can have a look at the, at, uh, I'm just afraid that I'm going to burn something, some of the ices. But let's put it on the, on the shell. And then we will we will test it from there. Okay. I hope fingers crossed it doesn't blow up anything. One and ten volt. Showing me light is on, it's not off. Get some voltage reading, nice. Ten volt getting supply from the power supply. Seventeen sixty six, seventeen sixty six, ten volt, ten volt. Our IC point three volt. Three point five volt. Then go out, 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 out. out. One is three volt, two is four volt. And six and let's check those ones seventeen sixty plus seventeen sixty plus seventeen sixty plus seventeen sixty minus seventeen sixty. Plus seventeen sixty minus seventeen sixty minus I don't understand why my look at my power supply. You see the red light and the current it's stuck on one amp and the voltage from twelve volt it dropped down to ten. So this I don't understand. I really don't understand. Anyway, let's try to see if this amp is giving any output. <laughs> you guys can hear. It's playing. <laughs> 
Okay, let me. I can't show you guys, but here you can hear. Um, all right, get some light for you guys. Channel one. You guys can hear? Definitely. And I can also make it like this. Look at my speaker, right? Guys. That's channel one. Then we have channel. Channel 2. Right. Let's swap. For channel... Three and four. Okay. Oh, I was so uncertain with this repair. Channel three, guys. Amplifier, the amplifier is fixed guys it is fixed i am so glad it is fixed 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 we have sound wow <laughs> uh it took me about two days i think because of lack of experience you see that capacitors was not easy for me to find out what value capacitor we could use it but i was lucky actually to get that uh, guy's video i must say thank you but the guy's num i don't know his name or i just only know his uh, channel something something anyway ah uh, i'm i'm really happy guys I need to end this video. It was a long video to cut a lot of things. As you see, I have a birthday party going on in the house. The kids are very busy. So I'll say as usual, like and subscribe, um, share my channel's info to your friends and family. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Okay. Take care.